I like to think that space exploration activities can have a huge benefit for Earth. To go to space, we leave Earth and then we come back home and we realize how special it is to live in this place. Today, I feel very comfortable with referring to myself as an artist, even though art wasn't the first thing that I studied. I come from engineering, philosophy, I even did some space studies in the International Space University. But today, even though I have all these references, I like to simplify the message and say that I just make art. Matters of Gravity was the first main project I developed with space technologies. We always experience gravity, like one of these universal forces. So let's reflect about it. And it happens that you need a space mission to do that. We did around 15 different art pieces, including a piece where people have to just touch each other and embrace. Being in zero gravity, you lose the physical experience of materiality of your body. And in that moment, you realize that you and nothingness are the same thing. But when you reach out and grab someone, you feel yourself again and you feel that you exist. It was a realization that, yeah, of course, I can only exist in relation to the other. I have the opportunity of launching an object into our space, an artwork. Is it something that I want people to watch? Is it something that I want a camera to watch? Or I want people to feel it? In my recent project, The Contour of Presence, the main ingredient is a box, and inside has a set of mirrors and lights and a camera that get activated with people's pulses. So this is installed inside the Columbus model of the International Space Station. You go into the museum, you see this mirror, and it's an invitation to touch the mirror and the mirror sends the pulses, your heartbeat, into outer space. And then the lights and the motors of this cube start activating, responding to your heartbeat. And you see in real time the image of the cube emerging through the mirrors, making this connection between your heart and the unknown somewhere in space. The main message of this project is to reflect on the politics of existence. The idea was to reflect on what does it mean to exist together with things that we don't even know that exist. I'm an artist based in Berlin, focusing mostly on video and photography work. And I collaborated with Naum on the Counter of Presence, directing a video installation in the exhibition of the piece that leads the viewers to then measuring their heartbeats and communicating with the piece in space. He's trying to approach space through a human perspective. It's always about people, it's always about Earth rather than space. The video we made is not about space at all. It really focuses on humans, which I think is really important for humans to connect to it. Is space the next artistic frontier? No, I think the next frontier is our minds and space is a tool that allows us to get out, turn around and look at ourselves and see in that big picture what we're doing. Today that we can have access to a rocket or to a nanosatellite or to the International Space Station, these are unique tools. And I also believe that we need more artists that explore these technologies. Hyundai Motor, connecting art and technology.